<laughs> rage reset that. We're, we're starting to... <laughs> I remember, I remember someone telling me Ninja Gaiden sucked, and that really bugged me for some reason. <laughs> like, I know I didn't make the game or anything, but that really bugged me. The, someone was like, oh, Ninja Gaiden sucks. Excuse you? <laughs> that was rude. We asked her, Washington's been changed to the name of the lab on her. Singing sensation, John Bon Jo. This is back when he was a, a sensation. <laughs> Would use a pig hunt for highly priced fun. Oh. Damn it, I was... Ah. Yeah, it's truffles. Yeah, it didn't let me answer it. It took me too long to answer the qu to read the question. Don't get horse. <laughs> they don't get a name. It's just horse face. It's, oh no, it's um, what's the name from that girl from Sex in the City? What can it should be named for daring swashbuckler John Bon Jovi and Italian explorer? And... Oh, that's Vespucci. Yeah, it's a marigold. Total dream hunk John Bunch. <laughs> Joey wants to determine the age of an ancient artifact. You know what? A lot of people don't like Castlevania. I've actually kind of figured that out because the main the main thing things that people don't like about it are the jump, which I actually understand, but that doesn't make it a bad game. More MTV. The only Beach Boy who actually surfed died by drowning. Name this dead drummer. These questions about everyone's favorite flying Batman. Okay. Minerva owned a health spa that catered to millionaires and was a character played by what Hungarian actor? Oh my gosh. I didn't know. Zaza Gor? Hey. Prime time, prime, prime time. And Silver Spoon. What is the full name of Ricky Schroeder's character? Well, it's not Ricky Ricardo. Oh, yeah, so I did. I realized I'm, I'm missing. Uh, I don't know where they went, but I'm missing the hands for Rob to, to hold the. The gyro spinner things. So I can't do anything with Rob until I get those. What city does the series 227? I mean, I'm guessing 227 is the area code. That'd be Boston. I, you know what? I, I agree with John. Every game does suck except for Where's Waldo. That is the pinnacle of gaming. Yeah, I'm still winning. That's all I really care about right now. Bald guys. These are people who are shining examples in their fields and the light catches their heads. They just, that's right, answer the question with celebrity chrome domes. He's everyone's worst nightmare, with or without hair. Name the scorched villain on. Oh. Hey, we got one. Brenda killing it. What scary headed character ran the only general store in 
Hooterville for Green Acres in Petticoat Junk. Ooh. I do not know. Mr. Essick. <laughs> Next week, Street Fighter V is free for like a week, I'm guessing. I'm not sure for how long, but next week, Street Fighter V is free. So I, I might jump on that next week and mess around with some characters. I think uh, Season 3 is going to be free. Let's play Doctor Insane Elsewhere. And you know what, uh, uh, I might be able to play it... Actually, I, might, I might use the PlayStation. Uh, it, it, yeah, because if I, if I use the computer, it'd be more work on the computer. I might just use the PlayStation. Big Bone and Balding actor Vic Tabak played a short order cook. I don't know, man. I don't know any of this stuff. Yeah, because yeah, it's... Well, and uh, it's free... On both consoles, it's, it, or both, it's free on the PS4 and the, and Steam. It'll be free. Another prime time. In what New York borough is Harry Stone's Night Court located? I was gonna guess Manhattan. Hey, we got it. <laughs> Another prime time. She married the king. She dumped the king. Now she stars on Dallas. Damn, I'm getting killed by Scully right now. Okay, the Batman stuff I might be able to get. These days, he's always telling us how to, telling us to make the right choice. But he used to play Cowboys. Movies. I knew it wasn't Charlton Heston. Since they got that one wrong. First break. We're losing. What is happening? Now for a commercial. I don't think that's supposed to be Colin Quinn. And there's just. That doesn't look like Colin Quinn at all. Colin Quinn doesn't have blonde hair. I guess, yeah, it was a big show. What is Elf's actual... What?! Gordon Shumway? Yeah. A 
soap. Oh no, soap operas. Hold back the tears and answer a question about the daytime melodrama being described. She, Vicks, and Erica finally got the baby she yearned for. For cornering a hunky state center, found this she tends for irresistible. Name Erica's newest husband. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it's not Travis Bickle. Oh, you know what? It's Travis. Yeah, Case. I, I, I actually figured out the logic of that. Because Travis Bickle is the driver in taxi. Right, in taxi driver. And then the other the other last name was the same, but it was meant to trip you up. So it was a Travis, but it was it was the other Travis again. Yeah, that actually had some logic to it. Mona Tyler of all my children. Dang, Susan is killing me right now. Gotta change, gotta change the subject. Scully. Jeez. Video high. Susan doesn't got no job, is what the problem is. I know that one. That Vinny Barbarino and uh, Horshack. <laughs> Welcome back, Mr. Cate. <laughs> I used to watch that on Nick at Night. When I was a kid. Is, is it a sport? Is it shampoo? Who really cares? What wrestler regularly has the phrase, don't be cruel, stitched across his tights? Oh, it's gotta be the Honky Tonk Man. Yeah, cause he's an Elvis guy. Yeah man, Nick at, <laughs> Nick at Night was awesome. <laughs> the wrestling channel. What's in that bag that always- oh god, okay. Snake. Get it, Jake. Doesn't Honky still have the longest reigning IC, like, IC title reign ever? Because the belt kind of like fell into obscurity, so like no one's really holding it for that long anymore. Or does the Miz have it? Because the Miz has had his, he, the Miz had the belt forever. He had it for like, uh, he had it for a long time. Certain social time, don't come for. for it. Is Cody Rhodes really? That's it. Oh, that's. Not Sand. No, it can't be Damien Sandow. He, he wasn't. He wasn't in the company long enough to even set that record. From Hogan's Heroes. What country was Newkirk from? Yeah, Miz does have the record. Okay, that's what I thought. Look at the... Oh, oh, we're tied. Get it, Susan. I, I, I could have swore they had they kind of made a big deal about him being the longest reigning IC champion because I, and I didn't. Um, Randy Savage had it for a really long time too. Name the feisty little corporal on Hogan's Heroes who loves croissants and wore a beret. Was uh, was the IC Championship up for grabs when when the Miz fought Shane? Or no? It was just because he was like defending his father or something, right? It was a the title wasn't on the line. The last for SummerSlam. Justin Bateman is a dopey but lovable star. What primetime sitcom is her brother Jason star? Jason Bateman. Con now. Yeah, we can con. Oh, 
yeah, oh yeah, yeah, Squirrel, you, you are, you know, so new to the channel, yeah, we, we, uh, we do, we try to pay, or I, I try to pay attention to wrestling still, so, every once in a while we'll devolve into wrestling, con wrestling talks, so, just a heads up, <laughs> yeah, but, in Bewitch, he was arrested for a solo, uh, It looks like we're about to win this. We're we're firmly in control now. Off the air. Very late in the game, frankly, Lauren. You're not exactly blowing us away with your grab. Oh man, Lauren's out of here. <laughs> Get out of here, Lauren. <laughs> Sarah Jessica Parker. That's what I was thinking of. <laughs> See you later, horse face. I don't need a character, you need a profession. Out. Get out of here, Scully. Oh, look at her face. Oh, that was weird. Alright, so yeah, I think we won. We have a winner. We got all of our hours in front of us. No TV. Oh, lost it. Damn it. Eh, it's fine. Yeah, so yeah, that was... That's all we had to do. We won. Next game. Um, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, you'll see that some of these are really short. Like, like uh, a handful, like uh, a lot of the baseball ones are like, you know, win a game or whatever. It's just the way that it is. We can do some Wheel of Fortune, that'd be fun. Yeah, Family Feud. It was fun because, yeah, because you know, and you know what? It was it was a different it was a different game every time we played. You know what I mean? Like it was actually like, in the end it was actually kind of exciting, but because you know, it came down to the last question. 